Alright, so what's up guys, it's Fiddles4, and different kind of video today, which is uh, kind of ironic because given the subject content, I'm wearing my Houston Heat shirt from back in my paintball days, but we're moving, which is pretty cool, uh, sort of. Given the circumstances, not really, but hopefully it leads to a better life. Uh, we are leaving the state of California because it's just nothing here for us anymore. It's too expensive. Uh, you know, my husband and I both work pretty good jobs, and best we could afford was basically a glorified apartment for our first home. And that's honestly pretty shitty, considering the amount of work we go through in our in our day-to-day -day lives. Uh, I am a unregistered veterinary technician, and, uh, you know, I make a really good money. Um, I'm leaving a job where I have worked for 10 years and started as a kennel tech kennel assistant like fresh out of high school all i had was some rop training um and i just learned a lot from the people with me over the past 10 years and by the time i left well by the time i am leaving now i should say um i'm the technician supervisor and manager kind of of the place so it's it's definitely really hard it's a big big change we still have some family that's out here in california um uh, but yeah, we out. The politics suck. The economy sucks. And uh, coronavirus was kind of our last straw. Like we had been wanting to leave California for a few years and then the Rona hit and our governor's response to that was really, really irritating. Um, but yeah, the I mean, the real driving factor was a death in the family of someone who was very close to us. Um, the flag that you can actually see right above my head right here my grandfather passed away and he was the last person that really couldn't uh, travel that we were very close to so not to call him an anchor but without him being here uh, everybody else in our family can still travel and can still come out and see us wherever we go so the big reveal is actually not Houston it's not it's Austin but so we're still going to Texas so I was like, hey, you know what? Like, let's make a video series about it. Let's just spend the whole year doing a once weekly vlog about what it's like to move out there. Um, so, you know, there's definitely some things that you hear about Texas, you know, like some like myths, maybe, maybe about to find that out. But, you know, like everything's bigger in Texas. Everything's cheaper in Texas. There's all kinds of like Texas American pride, like just ego, 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 which is kind of cool. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie there. Um, you know, there's always kind of uh, stereotyped as a bunch of overly right leaning cowboy rednecks. Um, I know that's definitely not the case in Austin because there's a bunch of hippies out there in Austin. But, uh, yeah, you know, you hear things like, oh, the people are so nice in Texas. Uh, it's all Texas all the time. Just Texas flag, Shiner Bach, barbecue brisket. Tex-Mex sucks, allegedly, is a rumor. I'm gonna find that out. I don't know. I'm a big fan of french fries inside the burrito and just wrap those little bad boys up. Just saying. It's about the only change I want to bring to Texas is throw some french fries in your burritos, y'all. Oh, the big one. They hate Californians. Hate us with a passion. Because they don't want us leaving California and bringing our California politics with us and changing up their beautiful state. I have no intentions of that. Except for french fries. In the burritos. With the carne asada. Wrap that shit up. Just saying. That's all I got. But anyway. So uh, I have a job out there. I took a 25% pay cut to go out there. But... You know, it's part of life, I guess. It's part of the journey. And, uh, yeah, I'm pretty excited. Having a hard AF time finding a place to live, though. But my husband's been working on that, so I trust and let go. But anyway, we'll call this, uh, I guess we'll call this the California Refugee or the California Escapist, something like that. I don't, well, I don't know when I'm going to edit this video and when it's going to say that. We'll see, we'll see what happens. Who knows? But uh, feel free to like, subscribe, follow along. Uh, and yeah, we'll see what this move to Texas is all about. We'll see what goes on out there. I know there's run fairs like everywhere. Literally like everywhere all the time. Probably not right now because it's Corona. But there's a small chance of us even getting together to go to the Texas Renaissance Festival 
again, making this our third year in a row, which would be awesome. So we'll see about that too. Anyway, stay tuned, YouTube and California friends and family who's still back there. Bye.